glad I'm back of training, guys. So what's up while I gone? We have more members to join. Oh, and Yandere Chan, meet our new teammates Kratziella and Jean-Marie. And girls, meet Ayano Aishi, she is known as Yandere Chan. Yandere Chan. Oh, are you Satare's friend? I am. Oh and your sister is fighting with Allison again. Oh, Allison is still talking to Raitera again. Who is Allison? Raitera's rival. Sure, that Jemina is Raitera's rival, but Allison hates Raitera more. They with your aunt. So my niece Raitera and her friend Ruby, is great to see both of you. But why both of you and Allison is in my office? Well Aunt Eliza, you know Ruby's boyfriend Vincent? Yes, I know her boyfriend Vincent. He used to be in the same school as Ruby. And Principal Allen, he's a friend of mine, why? Well Headmistress Kumamoto, Allison says mean things to us because Trip is trying to sneak to my old school. And worse, Allison says she going to ruin your niece Britter's life. Who's Trip? Ruby told me that he's a another troublemaker to not only bully Ruby's boyfriend Vincent, but also anyone else, as well. Trip's girlfriend Alexine told my friend Ruby about that. Don't worry, Ruby and Raytera. It's good that told me about Trip. Thanks, Aunt Eliza. You're welcome. I give you girls two weeks off for tell me the truth. I'm very proud of both of you. As for you, Allison, are you threatened my niece and her friend about Trip and his gang? Tell me the truth. Um, I can't, ma'am. Shut up. I, I had enough of you bother my niece. That's it. You are expelled forever. Okay. Get out. Okay, I tell. I did told them about Trip and his gang. Plus, Alexine has a message to Vincent about terrorize the school. Please, I'm very sorry. Can you forgive me? Well, I calling your mother already. But, she know the answer, Allison. Oh, hi mom. Don't you owe, oh, hi mom me, Allison. I'm very angry at you, right now. Go to the car. But mom, is there fault that they get? I said now. Now March. Wow. I said shut up. No more Roblox for three months. Also you are expelled, Allison. What are you talking about? And who's Ned Flemkin? Ned Flemkin is the guy that Andrew and Lucy told us about him. Yandere Chan, he is a troublemaker who ruined Andrew's birthday. And plus, he bullied our cousin Mai. What's the matter, Yandere Chan? Well, you know Kyle Kadanoya, right? Yeah, we know him, Ayano. He is known as Hypermaxed Frostbite and a technician, why? Well Marsha, while you guys at the Halloween party, me, Kyle, Maddie and the Russian girls are met with Ned, Kokapuri, and Krizel. Um, is something the matter? Javon? Your boot's kicking my legs, Tala. I'm very sorry, Javon. So Yandere Chan can you tell us what happened with Kyle? Okay, it happens when Kyle went to the train with his girlfriend Maddie. Ugh, I can't believe that Chief don't let me have Halloween party. So not fair. Ned Flanken. Oh, hey Chief. I'm your father, not Chief. And you better behave, Ned Flanken. Behave? For what? To ruin my life, Chief? No. Your mother and I are going to take your sister to Halloween party, but you are still grounded. Gee Chief, grounded your own son in Halloween, that suck. You better watch your tone, Ned Flanken, and stop calling me Chief. Fine, Dad. Whatever. Just go. That's better. Well, at least the leaves are cleared. I'm going to see my girlfriend rather chief like it or not. Okay, is only 7 o'clock. I'm taking the train to Vyond City. Well, it says that I'm fighting some chick named Kaori Nozawa. What's the matter, Kokopuri? Meow, well Valentina, I have to fight Kyle Katanoia. He's the male version of that mean tailor, meow. Plus, my moms are still grounded me for prank these spies of heroes. Wait, Kokopuri. Did you just said Taylor as in Taylor Jolie Kerr? I did Ned, meow. 
Yo no quiere. Yeah, I know her, Valentina. While Kyle is the strictest male member, Taylor is the strictest female member. Plus, she came from the spies of detectives as the mean boss. She and the others get me into trouble and have to stuck watching that Andrew Orozco jerk. It sucks. My girlfriend Crizel knows her too. Who's Andrew Orozco? He's the guy who make a grounded video out of Viley Anderson, another troublemaker and the leader of Ultraviolet Racketeer and troublemaker group. Plus, Andrew has his own crew as Andrew's crew. Man, I hate that Orozco jerk. Poor baby. Well, is your fault. God. Not her again. Is that Taylor Holico or you told me about, Ned? Is not her, Valentina. Is worse. She one of the members of Night Singers, her name is Mitch Magnonia. And she sucks. That's right, but you watch your mouth, Oscar. I'm Ned Thomas Flemkin, bitch. And what the hell do you want? I'm the idol, and you better watch your tone. But actually, I hear for Cocopery Cats. Me? Why meow? Kyle want Kokopuri to fight him two weeks by now. He's in the next car. As for you, Ned, you're next. I going to kick your mango bitch ass. I heard that. You better shut up. And get out. It's great that we are watching 14 hours of child's play. I hope no one ruin our movie. Especially, Charity and, and Danger Prone. They always ruin our movie. Bye, Ruhuruku, Lakwisha, hello, Xanfi and Cousin Rebecca, your mother want to talk to you. I know you girls are watching the movie, but it's very urgent. Uck, I knew that Charity is ruin our movie. But she's Rebecca. Viley, Lakisha, Ryoko, Ella, Xiangfei, and Rebecca, you heard Rarity. Get your asses in the living room right fucking now. Uck, fine dad. We're going. Xiangfei, can you pause our movie? Sure. Viley. This fashion girl giving our freaking nerves. Ugh, she always ruin our movie night. Viley, Lakisha, Ryoko, Ella, Ziang Fei, and Rebecca, the reason why you are here is because Rarity told us you bullied Freya Magleby. Is that true, girls? You better tell us the truth or all of you girls are extreme grounded. Got it? Ugh, fine we will tell you. Jeez. We did bullied Freya Magleby because she loves a object named Pen. And we think their relationship sucks. We are sorry. Is just their relationship is back and drama. That is why they are not a cute couple. Yeah, is what they said, Mr. Anderson, Mrs. Anderson, and Mrs. Kawamura. They're a worse couple. And is our own opinion. We know is not right, but we only did that because they're not a great couple. You'll thank us later. We promise we'll never do it again. Pinky swear. We promise we are good girls for now on. You did what? Oh 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 Viley Margaret Anderson, Lakisha Monique Knight, Ryoko Kawamura, Ella Bridget Watson, Ziang Fei Lukim, and Rebecca Jane Olm. How dare you girls not only breaking these couple up? But also says you are going to bully Freya just because Pen is an object. That's so it, you are grounded until Lana and Riker are getting married. No movie night for tonight and instead watch Andrew or Osco movie. Get to the room right fucking now. Good luck being grounded girls, you fight me later. Rarity is right. No more child play. But Kaa-san, Andrew Orozco 6, and his- Now. Ugh, fine. I know the members of the Space of Airways. Yes, I'm Kyle Kadaya, this is my girlfriend Maddie Martinez, and our friend Diana Icy. Are you girls new? Yes, I'm Ivana Fedorov. Hello, I'm Aliana Vasilev. I'm Amasl Chik of St. Petersburg. Hi, I'm Yana Alexeyev, I'm Sergei's sister. And I'm Mila Kasanova, a beauty member of Moscow, Russia. And we have this bad guys also from Russia. Who are they? Mila? This for a bloodki who we have to fight. I'll show you who they are. Oh no, that's these male troublemakers that you have to fight? I'm afraid some, my dear. My sister fit to eat Clara is anything. But the sigus we have to fit to source. Not too smart, is my opinion. I'm Damya Obrazumov, Russian school fatty bully troublemaker. I'm a fat boy who take their money and I can have to use it for food. 
Also, I'm too big so I can't hurt. I'm Sasha Vorongin, also known as a Russian hit boy troublemaker. I'm Shashkov Shenyu, known as the Russian gamer troublemaker. Kirill Nazarenko is my name. I'm a Russian runner troublemaker. Ivana, Uliana, Yana and Mila, if you're watching this, we boys will kick you girly ass. Seriously, we Russian ladies will be this idea TSS. Ivana, what's that really mean? What you know is saying that idiot means idiots in Russian. Aren't you at you say sorry to you? We will be at this boy so. What about Vanilla Puri's sister named Coca Puri fight against you? I did told Mitch I'll fight Coca Puri two weeks from tonight. I can freeze her. And tonight, Cal will fight Coca Puri cats. Yeah, dear Jan, do you know the place when they fight? Boris Anderson knows, but he hates Taylor and Strawberry. Boris Anderson, who is that? He's a the strictest father of his kids, and plus, according to Taylor, Kenzie, and Strawberry, he's the worst employee. However, he did told Raijin about the place that Kyle and Coca Puri will fight. He's good, except one flaw. What one flaw? And Sinko says that Raijin and Patty is visit Raijin's uncle for the weekend. However, Someone else will take Raijin's place since someone knows Boris than us. Jeepers, yeah. But who? Who knows Mr. Anderson than us? What? Is me, right? Oh, good grief. Don't worry, Taylor. You join team with Graziella and Strawberry. The rest of us will stay here with Yandere Chan about see the battle between Kyle and Kokopuri. Call us about Boris's behavior. So Raidero, what about Rizuki and Emily? Just taking care of it, Graziella. I ask Aunt Eliza for Gustav if he'll be the butler for Rizuki and Emily. Is a punishment for Gustav for ruin Aunt Eliza's birthday. Um, Aunt Eliza? Who's this guy? I know him, Rizuki. He's Gustav. My dad know him. He's one of the troublemakers who ruined them. She's right, Rizuki. If you don't know, Gustav ruined my birthday yesterday, so as punishment, his parents will force him to do my chores, as queen of a day. I know I'm you and Raisuk, but can you and Emily help me deal with him? Of course me and Emma are going to make Gustav do the chores. But first, I'm starving, auntie. I'm starving too, darling. Headmistress Kamamoto, can you as Gustav if we can get pizza for dinner? Sure, Emily, I'll call him. You heard my nephew and my soon-to-be niece-in-law, Gustav, make them a pizza. Make your own pizza, bitch. You disrespect my wife again, Gustav knows nothing, sir. Okay, Taylor, Graziella, and Daphne, will stay here while you girls talk to Mr. Anderson. But, only to tell where the place that Kokopori and Kyle are fighting. Strawberry will meet you girls soon. Good luck. You're mine, Boris Anderson. Oh, 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 oh. oh, my freaking god, Taylor and Strawberry. How dare you ruin my life just because I'm light to the customers. That's it. You both are grounded for four months. Go to your room. But, we didn't do anything, Boris. Yeah? We are sorry that we ruined your- I said now, got it. Okay, we'll leave now Mr. Anderson. Ah, what a great dream. Hmm, I wonder what's that noise. I guess I can find out. Oh no, not these girls again. Well, 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 look we have here. These bitches again. Bitchy jackass, danger prone bitch, bitchy wannabe, and purple bitch. You better not ruin him. Especially you, bitchy jackass. Is Taylor Jolie Kerr? That new Blake. Sophie Cat, but you can also call me Strawberry Nicholas. And I'm Griselle and Olsen. Are not leaving until we talk to Boris Anderson. Oh sure, Boris told me and Katie that excluding Daphne or Graziella, both Strawberry and that bitch ruin his life. Oh, and I know you purple bitch. Faye, I don't know you. Not you, Graziella. I meant her, the danger prone. Faye, you know her. Yeah, I know her, Roxy. 
She and the other girls ground me for not tell where Skylar and Fifi, and I hate Rarity, as well. You bitch. First this bitch spoils the movie, now I'll beat you and- You leave them alone, Roxy! Ugh, not Charity again. Oh no, Faye. Is the same girl who grounded you before. And what she did to Ned. Is this bitchy mango-haired bitch that Ned was talking about, but, why Ned's parents is here? You better tell us, bitch. Tell me why you have Ned for? Tell me. Oh, calm down, Faye. I know you ask when Ned is here with his parents. It's because other than Mr. Anderson, Ned know about the place, but he can't squeal. But you'll let us later, Ned. Like I have a choose, Rarity. You better not hurt her. Ned Flanken, you better tell Rarity, Mitch and Vanilla Purry the truth where's Kyle and Coco Purry at, or you are grounded. You heard your father, Ned Flemkin. Where is the place? Will you shut your goddamn mouth, bitch? I was about to tell Chief where is the place if you just shut up. Ned Flemkin, you better watch your language and tell them where are they or you are grounded even more, don't it? Ugh, fine. I'll tell. Poor Ned, we are going to beat Mitch and Rarity once we see them again. Jeepers, well Faye, is your fault that you didn't hear both moms about the fight and Skiller. So, we make Ned tell where Skyle and Cockaburry. Oh, is a little payback, Benelli. Will you shut up, Blake? Rarity is bad enough, then Julia Nicholson, and even bitchy jackass, but you? How dare you, Blake? I hate you. Besides, I heard that Fred is making out with Roxy Harrington. She says your boyfriend is hot. What was that? Fate Vanily. Gee, I thought most redheads are smart. I said I heard that Fred is making out with Roxy Harrington. She says your boyfriend is hot. Oh no, it's starting. You leave right my pretty alone, Faye. Because you have to tell your sister that Roxy Harrington made out with my children. 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 You're a great person to have out with my children. Just because you are a great person to have out with my children. Do something you have to ruin this time to ruin you. You're a mean child. You're a danger prone. I think you guys will have a next scene. You're mine. Kokabri. Mew, I'm scared. Meow, Kyle, please. Don't kill me, Meow. I'm not going to kill you. I'm actually going to freeze you, Kokabri. Meow, I'm too cold to fight. I surrender. I give. Meow. Just get this guy away from me. Meow. Good. Who's next? Best fight ever. Goodbye, everyone. <laughs>